Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all doing well. And if you're a new viewer, then welcome to Pie in the Sky Tools. My channel aims to bring you quality setups, tutorials, tips, guides, and tours from Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. So do check out my other videos and please do like and subscribe if you enjoy the content as it really helps others find my latest releases. In today's video, I'm pleased to announce that Matt and his talented team have now successfully created a new build of the OpenXR Toolkit, which works with the Vario Aero. So this is great news for all Aero users. Now you'll be able to use this tool to get an even sharper and smoother experience in this already amazing VR headset. As you can see, I'm currently experiencing some great results with the tool enabled. I won't go through the setup since it's the same as my first tutorial, which you can see if you click on the link at the top of the screen. However, I will share my OpenXR Toolkit upscaling settings, which you can see here. I have the upscaling set to FSR, the factory is set to 85% and the sharpness is set to 60%. I'm running the world scale tool at 95%, which gives a good perspective, especially in combination with the automatic IPD adjuster, and it looks fabulous. This is something you may want to try, but remember, we all have different IPD measurements, so you just gotta figure out which one works for you. And here are my in-game settings, which I find give me a balance of clarity and smooth performance. Notice I have the in-game render scale set to 100, in combination with the settings at default in the Vario base software. Using this tool with the Vario Aero really pushes the clarity and sharpness and improves the performance even more in the simulator. My advice is to take some time to experiment with the OpenXR Toolkit until you feel you've dialed it in and are happy with it. For more information about my other settings when using this headset in the sim, you can click on my video above and this will explain them. As always, I will leave all the links in the video description for your reference. And please do leave your comments and feedback on how the OpenXR Toolkit has helped you improve your VR experience in Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. And do check out my video if you want to learn more about the World Scale tool, which is part of the OpenXR Toolkit. Thanks for your support, and I appreciate your comments and interaction on the channel. As always, I hope you find this content useful, and look forward to making the next video soon. In the meantime, as always, take care, and stay safe.